Hi everyone, welcome to Module 4. For Module 4, you're going to be reading Chapters 6, 7, and 8. You're going to have Discussion Board number 3, and you're going to have your Connect work. With the Discussion Board, please make sure to note that your first post, let me go to the discussion right here. Your first post is due by Thursday of the first week of the module. You need to have two peer responses by the end of the module. Any peer responses could be to any of the questions that I asked in the course. You also need to make sure to have three to four paragraphs in in-text citation and reference and APA formatting to properly answer the question. And if you have any concerns, please let me know, but I'm looking for the development in your work, and that's very important. For this week, we're going to be looking at the role of elasticity. And elasticity is focused on how consumers respond to price changes. You'll notice that consumers are very sensitive to price changes, and they have to make decisions on what they're willing to buy based off these changes in their goods and services. A good can either be inelastic or elastic. An inelastic good is a good where consumers are very sensitive to the price change. For example, if the price of a good changes, uh, there will be a large change in demand. However, an inelastic good is when there is a change in the price, there is a very small change in the demand. So what you need to focus on this week is how consumers evaluate elasticity and you want to focus on the two, two different types of elasticity, elastic and inelastic, and relate how they, uh, how they uh, relate to you in terms of things that you have purchased and maybe not have purchased. If you have any questions, please let me know, but I look forward to your effort. And please make sure to complete all your work by the due dates. 